ったグ町は空も地上も警官だらけだぜダイルスなんか分かったのか残り6つのカオスエメラルドは地上のどこにも反応がないんだもしかしたらエグマンたちは宇宙にいるのかもしれないえー、マジこの先は全て行き止まりだ手を消して探せマックレスよう2人とも久しぶりだないや参ってぜエメラルドのかけら探して炭鉱の方を回ってたんだが出るとき迷っちまってでここどこだまっなんだよいいからどきなさいよ政府のコンピューターに大統領とエッグマンの更新記録を見つけたよ僕今大統領のリムジンを追ってるんだ乗り込んだ通信を逆探知すればエッグマンたちの居場所がわかるよオッケーじゃあそこで合流だあーちょっとステイルス大統領はこの先にいるはず追いかけるぞ Hello everyone and welcome back to Sonic Adventure 2. My name is Cosmic and we are playing as Tails right now in a car. I know, what a weird way to start off the episode. Last episode, we found out that Eggman blew up half the moon in order to achieve world domination and we are currently on the hunt for him. Currently, I suspect he's in space because, you know, the space colony arc, the cannon, you know, everything there. It's just a little bit of a hint that he's using that. But the characters don't quite piece that together yet until after this stage. So let me explain what you do in this stage. You have to make it to these checkpoints where your time will be extended before your time in the top left runs out. If it runs out, then you are screwed and you will have to do this stage again. Luckily, the time limits are usually pretty generous. That first one is actually pretty much the hardest for a newcomer because after this, it pretty much goes on to 99 seconds or more in the next checkpoint, which just honestly solidifies to me my theory and me being correct, <laughs> as per usual, because guess what? I am always correct. That is just a fact. I am always correct. Let me just stroke the ego a little bit. If you bump into the walls, tails will slow down. It's the same rule alongside the cars. There are cars obviously driving by this highway. There we go. Time extended. Tails, did you find the president? Shut up, Sonic. Uh, exactly. Just a little more Sonic. Hold on a bit. Jesus. He's always harassing me on the phone. Aye, aye, aye. Anyway, we need to drive and be sort of careful here. Uh, there is a variant of this in the dark story. And we'll get to that character when we get to that character. But let me just say I do not like their car's design. Uh, I don't care about the A rank, but it would be like a power move to get an A rank in this stage. Not that I can see myself getting it. I will probably get a B rank or below, which honestly is fine. I just want the power move, honestly. <laughs> can you imagine me with an A rank on this stage? That is very... To, to me, it feels slow. Anyway, <laughs> no, I have not got this A rank whatsoever. I keep on landing into the walls too much. Anyway, power boost. I don't think I've got it, but this is the last line. So hopefully I can get to the president in time because that's what we're supposed to do in this stage. I doubt I am going to make it in time. No, it was 2.45. We were at 2.46. So unfortunately for me, that leaves me with, yeah, there we go, mission clear, a B rank. That's fine. Anyways, I'll see you in the next stage. The incident has been passed for 3 hours now. The government's crisis is the government, the government, the government, the government, the government, and 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 the government. <笑>君の意見は結構だ。で、そちらの要求を聞こうか、ドクターエッグマン。話が早いではないか大統領。忙しい君のために手短に話そう。こちらの要求は単純明快じゃ。無駄な抵抗はやめて我がエッグマン
貴様らの国が消えてなくなるまでよ返事は24時間以内じゃ No way! No. <笑>よっと貴様ソニック何がエグマン帝国だな、なんなんだ君たちはそうかっかなんてことをしてくれるんだ奴のことは俺たちに任せとけってどうなっているすタッチ成功場所はアークっていうスペースコロニーだよ OK レッツムーブエット待ってよソニック、ま、大丈夫だ、ま、たかエージェントからの定時連絡が入っていますわあのピラミッドの中にああエッグマンのやつが入ってくのを確かに見たぜそれよりあのコウモリ女がエッグマンたちと一緒だったってのは本当なんだろうなうんきっと宇宙に出るための手段が何かあるはずだスペースコロニーだからなんだか知らないがあのでかい大砲ごとやつらをぶっ飛ばしてやるあ,あ僕入り口探してくるよ Welcome to stage 10, Hidden Base. This is the first of the pyramid stages. And what you want to do is you want to come over here and hit these dynamite packs. There is a trick to getting onto these walls. And、um, if we go here, for example, I might be able to show it. Oh, <laughs> if excuse me, Tails. If, if, if you jumped high enough,、uh, you should be able to do this where you don't have to hit the actual dynamite packs. Um, but you will have to hit dynamite packs. Usually, it's just a case of I'm good at the game, so I don't necessarily need to.、Um, in terms of this stage,、uh, there are a few things、uh, that can trip you up, like that, if you don't move out of the way quick enough. And an upcoming section, which I've spent way too many times grieving the loss of my lives over. This robot, very sneaky, wait before it comes down, otherwise, you will be caught off guard and you will be assassinated, right? We agree on this, good. Because <laughs> that's what happens to me all the time when I'm not paying attention, honestly. And when I was new at this game in like 2012, I fully had meltdowns over that enemy because I was trying to A rank it. These enemies are、uh, Kiki's. They、uh, appeared in the last game, Sonic Adventure, which I will be doing a let's play of in the future. And they throw bombs at you. And there are two variants one that throws a spike bomb at you, and one that uh, uh, throws a normal bomb at you. This is an Unidas, which appeared in Sonic 1 and in Sonic Adventure as well. I believe it appeared in other games, either that or it was the Soul.、Um, or I could get my information wrong here. Either way, it was in the last game and it's in this game as well. Pretty much every enemy in the Dr. Eggman Force、uh, that was basic enough、uh, that Eggman had. And could rebuild in this game for like the lore and everything. They decided to go ahead and add them into the pyramid areas, which to me reads as okay, so they know the continuity, that's very good. And I want everybody to pay attention to when the moon blew up, because in later games, that moon will stay the same. We saw it in Sonic Colors, for goodness sake. It was very embarrassing to look at, honestly. But, anyways. We're gonna come over here. I'm gonna get this Kiki. Excuse me, sir. There we go. <laughs> Why did Tails stop? Was he, or did he class himself as close enough? Tails, stop it. Hello, Unidas. How are you doing?、Um, the Unidas also appear in Death Chamber, which is Knuckles' stage in this video. So I just want you to keep an open mind about that. I don't like the enemy because it has spikes around it, but they're pretty easy to defeat. I don't like spikes in general, so. That's just me. What we're gonna do is we're gonna come here. Oh my god, I thought I was about to die. I was about to have a heart attack.、Um, and we're going to come all the way up here. In this stage, you can get the Mystic Melody with Tails. I'm not going to obviously, you know, reveal where it is, but I want you to look for yourself, you know? I want you to find it. Maybe we'll do a bonus episode where I show you where all the Mystic Melodies are, as well as the Chow Garden. I feel like that would be good. Um, but, anyways, this is the goal ring. We are just about done with Tails for this episode. Let's get in that goal ring. What rank did we get? We have 9990 points. 
So I'm hoping that we can get carried to the A rank. Yes, we did. Love that. Welcome to Pyramid Cave, Sonic's, uh, hold on, Sonic's fourth stage, that's it, sorry, I got a little bit sidetracked there. Uh, Sonic's fourth stage in this story, out of six, because we got two more Sonic stages before we end off uh, the Hero Side story. It, it doesn't end this episode, so don't worry if you're, if you're scared that it's gonna end. It ends next episode, and then we move on to the Dark story. But anyways, this stage introduces the concept of hourglasses. Flip the hourglass to open the door. Doors close when time is up. So you gotta make sure that you get to where you need a head before the hourglass's time is up. This hourglass feature is also featured in uh, the next stage, but we'll get onto that, you know, in a little bit. This is an E100 series robot as I get the bounce bracelet, which allows us to press the B button whilst in mid jump to use the bounce attack. So basically it allows us to jump higher. This is the E100 robot. I don't know why my game lagged out there for a second. I am terribly sorry. It's being weird. Anyway. <laughs> Let's go up here and let's go over to this switch thing here. Let's put the switch into the, the pedestal area and let's grind because we don't need to go through all of that. No ma'am, I think that was Big the Cat up there, I'm not too sure. Hello, there were boos everywhere instead of hurting you like they do in Knuckles stages, they just stop you. So you want to avoid them ideally. Uh, because you will be slowed down and you don't need that. Excuse me, excuse me, this boo is especially devastating if you, if it gets you in the wrong, sir, <laughs> if it gets you in the wrong areas, because you don't need that right now, uh, in this stage, you can wait until Knuckles stage to fight them, it's more, um, it's recommended to avoid them in this stage because obviously it ruins your stuff i mean i got hit and then i got grabbed as you saw i couldn't move but anyways let's place this switch into this hole excuse me sonic there we go jump let's place the switch in the hole hello omo chow that thing is omo chow i forgot to mention the very first episode actually excuse me excuse me you shouldn't have grabbed onto me oh my god things are not going my way you can go through those hoops to get extra points I just want to speed through though, so that we can get on to the next stage. Uh, excuse me, excuse me. I call that rude. Uh, anyway, <laughs> you we, we need to speed through here, but you could have gone through those rings to get some bonus points. It's not for me though, I'm sorry. I just know. <laughs> just know, girl. Just know. Anyway, we have 20 rings to our name. That's depressing. Um... So, we're gonna beat up this uh, E100 robot and not get the golden B. Oh, wait, yes, we did! Good for me! Good for me, you know. Let's also get that extra life. Um, I am really enjoying recording this series so far, I will say. It's uh, pleasurable, let's just say that. Pleasurable uh, to, to play through. It's just, it's magical to me at least. It's it's wonderful. Uh, there we go, goal ring. Yes. Yes. <laughs> but I let him say that first. But what's our score? Fourteen thousand. Not the A rank. It's a B rank. I'll see you in the next stage. あの、Welcome to stage 12, Death Chamber. This is uh, one of my least favorite stages, but immediately we're going to go off to the side here to get the hammer gloves, which allows us to break iron containers. Uh, yes, I know, Omochao. Oh my god, I'm being too, I'm being tutorial run. 
<laughs> the E100 series robots are in here as well as a variant of the Unidus um, called the Soul that I briefly mentioned in Hidden Base. The Soul has fire going around it, which is um, very scary uh, when you aren't prepared. But this is the last stage where we're going to see any of the Eggman mechs or robots, sorry in this uh, game, unfortunately, in the hero side story. Uh, in the dark side story, we will be seeing them again. Uh, white family, wow, wow, what a clue. <laughs> white family, gosh, that's just, wow. Uh, did not mean to get the hint, by the way, did not mean to get it, um, but I was just in its pathway. Uh, they placed them in some awkward positions, I'll say that much. That's my thoughts on the um, the placement of the hint monitors. <laughs> but we're going to get this lightning shield. We're going to drill through here and uh, hopefully find white family. <laughs> Goodness, why did they call it that? Aye, aye, aye. Right, let's get this. Let's go quickly. There's the soul. This is a soul. Uh, we do not want to... Like, we... Oh! Oh, look at me getting an emerald or a master, em uh, master uh, Dr. Eggman key out of order. You can do that, by the way. As you can see, the radar is locked, um, which just begs the question as to why. <laughs> but that's just me. Uh, eh, it's This stage is all right, um, if you know what you're doing. I'm obviously flapping like an idiot right now, thinking I know what I'm doing when I really don't. Uh, hello, E100. Uh, fun fact about the E100s, they are built after the character of, uh, Gamma. Gamma was a character where the green flame lies. Thank you, I did not need a hint, but thank you, because I was on the right track. I hate how the hint monitors are, like, in my, in my way. Oh, the white family. This is what it means. <laughs> I was like, white people? No. Uh, but anyway... <laughs> Oh, I wanted it to smash Omochao in the face. Uh, but anyways, let me say anyways like three times. Oh my goodness. Uh, did I just lock myself in here? No, there's got to be an hourglass here. Okay, there we go. So, with this last Emerald or uh, Dr. Eggman key, Pyramid uh, key, uh, I want to say that you can find a statue, uh, a key on the statue's uh, behind. Uh, wait, wait. Is it? Oh my god, you know what? That was close. They can appear on the statues behind, aka their butt. Anyway, <laughs> did I get the A rank? I sure hope I did, because that was a good run for me. Yes, I did. Yes, I'll see you in a minute. We're in a sec. <laughs> Welcome to the boss, or one of two bosses, of the Pyramid Saga. This is King Boom Boo. King Boo Boo has an actual, actually has a variety of attacks. He will launch his fire at you to start off with, and then when he gets bored of that, if you can maintain a distance, he will spew out blue fire and he will stay in place, allowing you to hit the hourglass that you need to make him shrink and hide in the ground. Once he's hidden in the ground, what you need to do is you need to drill in the spot where his shadow is, and then you just need to follow him uh, everywhere. <laughs> like I was trying to there. You can hit him a number of times, uh, but unfortunately, because Knuckles just randomly stopped, I genuinely don't know why he randomly stopped. I was not able to get in three or more hits. He takes four hits to take down. King Boom Boo will enter this attack once he's at half health or lower, as far as my research goes. And um, he will chompy 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 if you get too close to him. What you want to do is you want to maintain a safe distance while continually moving. And you want to make sure that he eventually does what he did before, where he, excuse me sir, I was going to say, excuse me, there we go. And once we hit that, we will get the sunlight into the pyramid once again. And hopefully, by the way, I love how the key was in this room in death chamber. That was really like, that, that was really symbolic to me. I'm sorry, it really was. 
Uh, so I want to... There we go, I got him. He's actually a really easy boss, it's just tedious. But, it's really nice how this room is the one where you found the final key, and I love that. I will, I, I will see you in a second. え、Welcome to the second and last boss of this video, Egg Golem, the Golem. So what he will do is he will slam onto the ground. And what we need to do is when we're on his, when we're at his back, we need to jump on these platforms, and then we need to homing attack, homing attack, homing attack, and then hit the thing on its head that's controlling it from Dr. Eggman. He will have a spinning attack as well, where he will put both his arms on the platform about 180 degrees away from each other, and he will proceed to spin around, and you just want to stay in a safe lower area, because he, when he smashes the uh, platforms in, you'll notice that, um, there you go, the platforms start to sink in. And uh, I just find that like really nice, because when he does his little like hand attack, it really hurts for me if, like, if <laughs> oh, he also has this attack where he uses both his hands, I was about to get onto that actually. Thank you for speeding it up. But I love how he has a variety of attacks for just standing around. It reminds me of Ifrit from Sonic and the Secret Rings. Obviously, Sonic and the Secret Rings would have had uh, the Ifrit take inspiration from this boss, obviously. But it reminds me of that. Uh, I believe he takes one more hit, if I'm not mistaken, and then we're done. And I will see you back at the story select screen for the outro. Look at me getting things correct. <laughs> たちのいるスペースコロニーか。みんな大丈夫。もうすぐ近くに射撃するから。大丈夫だって。どうせマスターエメラルドの And I think that will do it for this part of Sonic Adventure 2. If you did enjoy this episode, don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. And check the links in the description below. I have been your host, Cosmic, and we're getting into the deep end of the hero side story. Can Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, and Amy stop Dr. Eggman? Find out in episode 4. Bye! Hey.